Hello, this is my 2013 LEGO Star Wars clone outpost on Alderaan, and I hope you like it. So the story is that um, the Separatists um, have, have been now sending off scouts to search the to search if there are any clones on Alderaan and they found a, an outpost and here it is the outpost is right over there so so yeah we'll be starting on the battlefield um here are just some droids I actually organized them of where they want to be or like this side um is for is the original droids this side commando droids and over there are mandalorians and there are just two um destroyers and here's count dooku and here is general grievous leading the attack and there are a couple of um dead droids like this one over here um they're dead because um a clone trooper over there over there has a um has a rocket launcher. Yep. So there's like kaboom. And over here, um the droids will have to be uh, going around this pond because um this pond is actually deadly. The clones um put in some deadly creatures. And that's why there's um a skeleton wait one of the clones, the early times, um, was helping to um, was helping to put in the creatures inside there, and then he got a bit too close, so then he got eaten up and spat out. Yeah, they're just like, and then next is just rocks there. So over here onto the clone side, um, the the um here. They, the clones have actually made a trench, and on this side, I've upgraded their weapons, which, which um, I actually put on technique pin or whatever we all call these uh, black pins or whatever, and I just attached them to the sniper rifles to make them look like um, the cool extended blasters. I'll just hold back there. And here are just like clones, and some clones have been trying to run up the trench, but as a result, they got shot. And so, like some clones are reloading, like um, like this clone and this phase two five hundred first clone over here as well. And here's Captain Rex and Commander Cody, and the guy with the rocket launcher. And here's a dead 501st Phase 2 Clone Trooper, and Phase 2 Clone Troopers running across the trench to us, to, um, help these guys out. Um, there's, and before we move on to the base, um, this is the first time I actually, um, made this brick roof, and there are, like, radar dishes, energy pipe, and shield generator. And some alarm horns. That's the entrance. And before we move on to the base, there's also something. There's also something at the back, which um, I really admire. Somebody um, who actually made this kind. It's actually very cool. I actually really like it. It's putting a Mandalorian in here in a dirt mound, planting bombs to go inside the base. So yeah, that's probably about it. And with the um roof, since they have st since um there are holes at the back, um what I did was to support it was to use um these bricks which have studs on the on their side. And it actually turned out really well. So now I'll just um take out the roof. If you got um, so that you can see the inside. Oops. Uh. Okay. 
Okay, if you want to now see, um, this is the inside of the base. Mm. So I'll start off with the command center. Um, here, um, well, first of all, I forgot to tell you that this is the first time I actually made a curved wall with a curved window. It's actually, uh, pretty easy, but if you do it like, like 180 degrees, that's, I think that's a bit hard. Over here we got control panel with this new clone in 2013. He's new and here are here are some Jedi's um on the hologram table and an admiral. You could um create um next time uh, tell me um what to call my admirals because um, I'm really out of ideas for names. Over here we have the armory, guns, and a clone trooper getting his helmet. Over here is just a speeder bike and the other one's missing because it got lost in the forest of Alderaan. Over here is the barracks. These beds are bunk beds and this clone's just getting his helmet because he heard explosions. So that's pretty it. Um, Please subscribe, this was a lot of hard work and you could tell me what um, basis I could do next. So after all, subscribe.